Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our Gospel Reflection for this Thursday, the 26th of May. And today we celebrate the life of St. Philip Neri, and I'll speak more to him after our Gospel. So we begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Gospel today comes from John chapter 16, verses 16 to 20. Jesus said to his disciples, In a short time you will no longer see me, and then a short time later you will see me again. Then some of his disciples said to one another, What does he mean, in a short time you will no longer see me, then a short time later you will see me again? and I am going to the Father. What is this short time? We don't know what he means. Jesus knew they wanted to question him, so he said, You are asking one another what I meant by saying, In a short time you will no longer see me, and then a short time later you will see me again. I tell you most solemnly, you will be weeping and wailing while the world will rejoice. You will be sorrowful, but your sorrow will turn into joy. The Gospel of the Lord. Today, as I mentioned, we celebrate the life of St. Philip Neri. Philip was born in Florence in 1515, and at the age of 18, he went to Rome and was working as a tutor. He did charitable work among the young men of Rome and started a brotherhood to help sick and poor pilgrims. He was then ordained a priest in 1551. He inspired other clergy to copy him and form them into the congregation of the oratory. This is still in many countries to this day. Philip died in Rome in 1595. One of the interesting things about Philip was that he was an enemy of solemnity and conventionality. Philip actually used pranks to fight against such things as pride, melancholy, and hero worshipping, just to name a few. Laughter for Philip was something that Christians should do more than anyone else. It's quite a change from what we would normally hear described for our saints. So mindful of the life of St. Philip Neri, in the tradition of our church, we pray, St. Philip Neri, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Thanks for joining me for our Gospel Reflection this morning. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Till then, take care, and God bless. Thanks, everyone.